Nancy Hornberger, professor at the Graduate School of Education. I'm an affiliated faculty member with IEDP. I do work on language teaching, language policy, uh, language diversity in education. My family had an example, made the example for me, modeled for me, I guess is the best way to say it. Respect for all people, really deep respect for all people. I learned that early on and have always had, I realize, a very strong sense of social justice. So being able to work with um, language minoritized groups and then later with indigenous groups who are uh, you know, among the most oppressed people in the world um, really spoke to me. I had already developed the interest in bilingual education, then I was living in Peru and developed the interest in Quechua and indigenous bilingual education. There were some interesting events that happened in Peru um, in the 70s when I was living there. That was when Quechua was made an official language and it really sort of alerted me to, the, to what language policy can do, to, the, to sort of the symbolic importance of indigenous languages. A lot of the work I do in my research side is what I've been recently calling ethnographic monitoring after Del Heim's idea from the 1980s. Being um, more short-term consulting and working with people on the ground doing the, the programs or the policies. I feel that over the years a lot of the impact that I've been able to have is really through mentoring students. At least I guess I'm proudest of, <laughs> of that work. I think my focus on indigenous education is, is quite unique. With the continuum of biliteracy um, that I developed out of my research here in Philadelphia, to be able to look at every aspect of uh, multilingual education from policy to classroom practice and to really try to understand all the factors that one needs to keep in mind to do a 